Hello, you're always calling all stations. What's this? Welcome to the 16 Lines Christmas Challenge. Your mission is to travel on all 16 lines noted on this map in the quickest time possible. First team back to Broadcasting House at the top of Regent Street wins. Why am I doing this? Really? Number eight will be halfway. This should be line six. So confused. The district line. Got to head east. Mm. So we've got a bit of a wait here. The overground is generally going to be slow down to Croydon. And it gets easier from now on because we're doing the quick ones. Yes. Yes! yes. Circle line. Woo! Look at that. So. Uh, central line, line number nine. So that's nine out of 16. We're not doing badly. So we are currently here at White City. I think what we plan to do is go all of the way to Bank, change to go down to the Jubilee line. So then that's, that'll be line number 10. And then out we go to North Greenwich to get number 11, which will be the Emirates Airway airline. Dangle way. It's a cheeky dangle. Um, so we've got another long ride ahead of us on the central line. Forever. We have been on this forever. We're only at Forest Hill. This is the longest train ride ever. Still only at Penge. Still only at Penge. We're still on it. <laughs> Penge. Yes, number 10. Jubilee Line, North Greenwich, and then Dangle, 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 Dangle. dangle. <laughs> I'm really curious as to where Andy might be, aren't you? That was only. This, this, this better be a station. Has he dangled it be yet or if not? If we ended up in the same dangle car, that would be quite weird. That would be very weird. Now, so red signal, we're just waiting for the platform to become available at the next station. No objection. We are about to commence dangling. It's very interesting. Over there is the dangler. Are you excited by the dangle? <laughs> of course. <laughs> Always. Um, so yeah, we're going to get on this, and it's going to take us over there to the GLR. And um, yeah, I, mean, I need to ask them about this mythical commuter mode, where apparently they make it all go quicker at commuter peak hours, so people can get to work on the cable car, which everybody does. Um, if I slip them a fiver, they might do that now, and we can beat them. <laughs> Maybe. Right. Hopefully, we can swiftly dispatch Tramlink because that costs us. That cost us dearly, I think. A using, long old time on the uh, getting the, the overground, overground all the way down from Canada Water. But that may have been, could have been a downfall. We won't know till later. So we we'll get this a couple of stops to East Croydon, and then we're going to whiz straight back into town, and then start to think about the final stretch, which is basically now ticking off all the remaining tube lines. Which in theory, shouldn't be it. Should be the easy bit now once we get back into town. But obviously, we've got to wait for our tram and. Uh, get to East Croydon, get a train back into town, and then we'll see, see, we, see how we're getting on. Off we go. So we are now officially dangling. We probably shouldn't have both sat at the same end <laughs> of the dangle because it's kind of it's, it's listing a little bit. I just forget how high this is. It's very high. It's quite scary. This is quite a frustrating bit because it takes quite a while to go across. Mm. Um, so you just really have to sit here and wait. There's nothing you can do. Where are you, Andy Carter? Are you in one of these pods? Um, so, Bakerloo, Central, District, Northern, Piccadilly, Waterloo and City and Victoria Line still to do. And it sounds like a lot. It sounds like a lot, but they're all compact now. So hopefully, this is now the easy bit once we get to London, Victoria. I think it's going to be into Victoria, District Line to Embankment, 
down to Waterloo on the Bakerloo line. That will then knock out the Waterloo and City line up to Bank and then we should be on Easy Street heading back in towards Oxford Circus for broadcasting next. Let's see how we get on. Now approaching London, Victoria. Jolly good news, <laughs> mate. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do mine because I can't. I can't live through that noise again. <laughs> well, you say isn't he? But there isn't actually a he involved, is there? Train. Is, train isn't it? Train. The train is called he. That's number 12 done. Perfect. Clearly the trains are on our side. A few precious seconds um, suffered uh, due to congestion. congestion on Very the, uh, busy on Victoria. The foot round works. Yes. Um, however, we've got, uh, we've got a district line first train in. One Either minute. We get district line, not a circle line, because that would undo some work. Yeah. Um, so that's good, that's going to tick this off. We're going to go to Embankment and pick up the Bakerloo line, go down to Waterloo, and then that's that's the final awkward bit because that's the Waterloo and City line done. We should be on home the home stretch after that. So, this is yes. number 13, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> Unlucky for some. Yes. Hopefully, lucky for us. Yes. Um, yeah, number 13. Uh, so that leaves us Waterloo and City, Metropolitan. Bakerloo, and we're done. Calling it London Liverpool Street, Overlay. Bankman is slightly complicated, isn't it? Oh, that sounds like it's leaving. Oh, no. Oh, it's left. Two minutes. Not too bad. It's not like, it's not like the seven minute wait. At, um... Not quite, but fortunately has briefly abandoned us. Yes. Let's hope that Every minute counts in this little trip. Yeah. Um, now, we've chosen the Bakerloo line rather than the northern line to go down to Waterloo because we think we can pick up the northern later on. It'd be slightly easier to pick up the northern at Topical Road. The interchange with the central line is not too bad. Yes. Yes. We know the way. We know the way. We know what we're doing with that one. Right. So we're now heading across a very busy Liverpool street. For the camera, which is never a good idea. I know. Um, but uh, we are heading for the Metropolitan Line to go yes. one stop. So off we go. Right at the bakery, he's not stepping back in time. He is. I quite like the Bakerloo. This is unfortunately a bit of an awkward interchange. I think you have to go out and in for this. This is incredibly lucky. This never happens. Or it's actually the one you want. It's the one that we want. Metropolitan line, number 14. Step right up. We're in the final stretch. Yes, we are. <laughs> so we're going to go to Moorgate, we're going to get the Northern Line to Bank. Yes. Bank for the second there. time today. And then it's Waterloo and City. We do like a Waterloo and City. We do like a Waterloo and City. And then it's Bakerloo and then that's it. So there are literally two more after this. And then the running might have to happen. Yeah, we have no idea how the other team are doing. Precious seconds. I haven't heard from them since just before midday. So. Yeah. This is, of course, the famous bit in sliding doors. That's no, not here anyway. All on the board. It never is. Go quicker. <laughs> so, this is a bit of an irritating interchange at Bank. Walk, 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 walk. walk. a lot of walking. I wonder how much running Victoria and David have been doing. So, Waterloo and City. A little bit of Northern Line that we didn't need to do, but we sort of did. Waterloo and City next. So, Waterloo and City Line done. We've only got four lines left to do. I mean, we could have picked any of the stations on the Waterloo and City Line to do. Um, we settled on, um, on these two. Central, Northern, Piccadilly, Victoria, and then 
we're home. We're done. We're done. So, to the central line. To the central line we go. This one's busy. Beautiful sound of a departing central line train there. What? <laughs> okay, we, we, we missed another one, but next one's coming in. Did you notice the man you were sitting, uh, standing in front of on the central line, he had a list of destinations and the time between each, each he station. Was something. I want to know what he was working out. I've got a cutaway. I filmed him. I'd love to know what you're working out if you're ever watching this, mate. One or another. Right, three lines to go. Northern, Piccadilly, Victoria, and we're about to get on the northern. We're on the home stretch. It's quite hot down here, isn't it? It's hot. I've uh, done a lot of rushing. Heading towards the loo, we are almost there. There's more rushing to come. Number 15, Waterloo and City Line. <laughs> One more. And we still don't know how well the other team is doing. No, I'd be really annoyed if he's sitting there with a latte in his hand. <laughs> Looking really smug. That's our job. That's our job to look yeah. smug. Determined not to miss another train this time. Um, and this is one of my least favourite interchanges. Usually because it's really busy, but there's nobody here. Check out that we are, stretch. We are at Leicester Square, right? <laughs> yeah. I remember what you said a minute ago. <laughs> How have we done it again? Every time. Precious, that, precious. That minutes. Bakerloo line change is cost well, basically, we'd be one train ahead every time. We'd be on that train. Or even further ahead, because the Northern Line would be on that train, the Central Line, we would have been on that train. So I hope it's not going to cost us. Potentially a nightmare scenario, yeah. But of course, it does all hinge on what the other team is doing right now. Yeah. Cut away. Go, 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 last one. Is it northbound? We just missed it. Don't let us down now, line number 16. The final line. What a beauty. Right, we've got to go. Where are we? We are here. And we've got to go to here. One, two, three, four stops. Let's hope he opens the taps. <laughs> of interchanges if you follow the signs um, I think we're on track I'm doing this mostly from memory of Jeff's map how are you feeling you feeling confident I think we've got this I think I'd, we've got it in the bag I'd, I'd be very disappointed I'd, I'd be absolutely heartbroken if we turn up another yeah here we are on the Victoria line and I can hear it approaching we finally caught up train now approaching last stop Oxford Circus and then find out if we won so that's it 16 lines done. We're nearly at Oxford Circus. We've got one stop away there. All 16 lines done when we get to Oxford Circus. Just got to see now. Running, probably not running. I'll be fine. Unless I see him, in which case I'll run. We'll run, we'll run. We've got to be there. Circus. Uh, the meeting point is the coffee shop at the bottom of the Broadcasting House, and we will see. We'll see if we've done it. Yeah, well, 
Looking through the windows. Can't see them anywhere. Can't see him. He's not here. He's not here. Oh, for David. Time check, please, sir. Uh, you pair of assholes. What time? 1609 and 19 seconds. We got here at 1518. What? What? Nailed it. How? <laughs> So, final final times. Yes. You did it in four hours, twelve minutes. And Alex and I did it in three eighty. Uh, very So post mortem of your route. Why did you go west? <laughs> Alex and I had a joke that said she wouldn't have gone west. That's mad. It was. It seemed to make sense that we weren't backtracking on ourselves, and we did like we fish bash bosh did at least four in half an hour. I was thinking, uh, yes, we're doing really yeah. well, but it was the long time on the central line and the district line that I think really screwed us over. And I didn't think to use that many trains because what I like about the tube is that they're so frequent. We did one running for a train at Clapham Junction, and I didn't really want to do too many of those. Yeah. So I didn't trust doing other rail connections because I thought they don't count towards the total, so I'm not going to do them. But yeah, the tubes slowed us up. So, but I'm, I'd be interested to see how you would have done from Victoria, because I think we had the raw deal. Well, we've been talking about that, and I have, I had an idea, I had a route planned from Victoria. So maybe next year we'll swap over and Alex and I will start from Victoria. You start from King's Cross, maybe run our route, and we'll see if my you idea can do any if better. I can do better from Victoria. Because I was surprised you went all the way down to Croydon to do trams. I was stressing about that for so long, I was like, I bet she's gone to Wimbledon, but I think I think it's going to backfire because it's going to be too too much backtracking. Yeah. But we, we were worried on the overground, we thought we'd binned it, but I'm glad we didn't. But it was good, it was a good exercise, <laughs> very tired now. <laughs> a good now. exercise of how you can how, how you can get around the, uh, all the tube lines in the quickest time possible. Yeah. Um, if you've got any better ideas of routes we could have done from either King's Cross or Victoria, let us know below yeah. comment I'm sure everybody's like going why didn't they do that it would have been what much are you quicker doing? yeah um, so yeah thank you for watching this special end of 2017 Christmas um, update I'll basically be back when I can no promises about when I just know I'll be back at some point so thank you very much for all your support over the years to calling stations for subscribing commenting and getting involved it's been absolutely fantastic um, so I have been Andy I've been Victoria. And from Alex and David, one of which is holding the camera. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you soon. Have a great holidays. Merry Christmas. Uh, oh shit. Heads, right, we'll start at King's Cross. Rightio. We'll Victoria. start at Victoria. We'll start at Victoria, which is appropriate because I am Victoria. It's my line, it's my station. And, and I'm not here. <laughs>